opportunity because I've always wanted to hold my own exhibition. So this is a very good chance for me to learn what it takes to um, put together an exhibition and execute it well. And it also gives me a chance to um, have a look into what what is the whole selection and curating process as well. Okay. During my engagements with uh, Mr. Jeffrey Wanley, I mostly help around with the daily, daily running of the gallery, um, its day-to-day -day activities as well as we will discuss about artworks and about um, basically about art, I suppose, and the, I think the greatest thing about being in Maya Gallery is like you're learning from so many different people, not just um, Jeffrey himself, but you have his, like, his wife and his team who runs Maya Gallery, so from that sense, I could, I could tap into all these different areas and that gives me uh, more to learn from, yeah. So we went to Bali, uh, I think about a few weeks ago, and it was like a really great experience um, because we, were, we visited a few museums and a few galleries and we met the, um, the artist uh, whose works you've seen here. Uh, and that was the best part for me, actually meeting the artists and seeing their space and talking to them and finding out more what their work is about as well as uh, what their art philosophy is about. My parents were really supportive of me uh, going into Project Protégé because I've always really been interested in the arts. And, but I've always been working on the artist side of things and this gives me a different perspective on um, art management and running like how art is really a business so it's a good it, it feeds back into my art practice I, I would say be true to yourself uh, follow your dreams of course but that takes a lot of hard work so uh, you need to you have to be realistic about things but at the same time do not forget your aspirations and yeah and just go for it <laughs> Oh, I would like to say a big thank you. <laughs> yeah, I would like to say a big thank you to Mr. Uh, Jeffrey Wanley for like uh, welcoming me into his gallery and like gi really giving me a really opening up my eyes and giving me like a no holds barred kind of um, experience here. Yeah. I would like to say thank you to uh, Mr. Jeffrey Wan Lee for giving the opportunity for me and Ernie to be part of uh, this experience together with Easy, the protege winner. Um, because without this opportunity, I don't think I would be able to learn as much, you know, to go travel with him, to go to Bali, to understand about artwork and to, of course, understand art management in Singapore and, and to know about this industry. Uh, I really uh, am grateful and thankful because he really could give the chance because not a lot of people could do, could do that. And not, a, not plenty of people can actually like, you know, accept you. And then, not, like, I don't really have any background in management, but I really love art. So it's like still part of the gallery. So I'm really thankful that he can give us the chance to just be part of the project. In view of the program, I had to choose one. But in view of the benefit for all, I told them that whoever I chose, whoever is not chosen, it doesn't mean that you're not good. But the three of them are welcome to join us and then work together as a team. Because in all aspects of, uh, of the uh, work or aspects of the uh, things that we're going to do, it takes a team to do the work. See? Yeah. So I, I guess uh, I guess easy was the uh, uh, the, uh, the, ch the choice for the moment. But I think if you ask me fairly, my choice is three of them. Indeed, they have come forward and the three of them have worked together very well and, and we're very happy because uh, I think with three, the force is better. You get to work together more, you get to gain more experience, you know, rather than have one. Okay, Easy, Easy was chosen after uh, a careful, careful uh, review, not just with me and also my team in Maya. So Easy uh, encompasses uh, quite a broad spectrum. Number one is that uh, she's also an artist. Number two, she's quite edu uh, of her education level and of uh, the drive to wanted to learn more in this aspect. And the, uh, the other thing is also the maturity. We treat them as a part of the family. So being part of the family, what do you do? We bring them into our work. So what we do is that we do everything. We do everything together. So it's just not doing menial tasks and everything. 
but they have an opportunity to be engaged in, in, in discussions, opportunity to look at uh, every aspect, every aspect of the business, every aspect of the, uh, the world, and then on top of that, they also get to do, uh, be involved, huh? be involved in every aspect of the work, whether it's preparation, whether it's delivery, whether it's installation, whether it's you know, the planning stage, and the other aspect that you could learn is also because we have we do have resident artists, so they will be able to explore and further the investment in art. Is it? One thing that we put for them as one of the uh, main projects is to do a project on their own. So this is what we're going to do sometime in November. We're going to call it uh, Pulse, and it's, a, it's an organized by them. So they are going to organize the whole thing by themselves with our guidance and uh, we're going to support them as many ways as we can. So I, I, I think this will be a very, very wonderful experience for them. Tonight's exhibition encompasses planning months ahead, right? So Easy was involved in the planning, Easy also was involved in the preparation, Easy also carry their artwork, Easy also cleans up their artwork. Easy also prepares the artwork. Uh, Easy also looks into the uh, selection, and Easy also is part of the exhibition. She is also doing uh, preparation for the food. She's also looking at the uh, uh, what they call it, the preparation for the uh, whole gallery. So Easy is everywhere, and so does the other two prodigies. I told them one thing. I told them that uh, you're here. You're part of the family. And you are not here just for a few months, but you are welcome here as long as you want, as long as we are here. And you are will be with us for the project, Protege, and you can be with us even after the project and even for years to come. We, we will develop it together. They all have different skill sets. Each of them have, have their strengths and I think that's important because there's no one skill that you know, to run a gallery, it's not, it's not, or any establishment for all that matter. Okay, Izzy Anna, she has a, a good background in um, doing research in uh, Tyler Institute as well as uh, National Art Gallery. Um, I think that comes in handy because we do need research to be done in the gallery. Uh, I ask her to do translations, you know, things like that. And then um, at the same time, she knows some people in the in the circle, which is helpful because she's an artist. At the same time, she does research, so it is it is a good development experience for her as well.